Namaskar, this is Saurav from India and in this video today I am going to talk about how do you integrate your WhatsApp for business with your Facebook advertisements. Now, you need to really understand that in 2019 a lot of people are going to use WhatsApp for business and Facebook as integration. Why? Because when people are clicking on your Facebook advertisements, they would earlier be driven to the website or they would be driven to a lead generation form from where they would send data to you or they would be messaging you on messenger but one of the most convenient platforms today is whatsapp for business because a lot of people spend a lot of time on whatsapp so when you are routing your customers from facebook advertisements to whatsapp and have some default replies set also some quick replies set this will make your life a lot more easier because you can immediately start conversing with them, save their number, send them messages whenever you want and whenever you post stories, they are more likely to see your update if they save your number too. So this is one of the most cost effective integrations that you could do for your business. So let's learn how do we integrate WhatsApp for business with your Facebook advertisements. So first of all, to get started, you have to log on to WhatsApp for business on your mobile phone. On WhatsApp for Business, you click on the settings section, which you see here. And as you click on settings section, you'll have a business settings section. From there, you click and you go to these categories up there. Now, as you come to this category, you have to click on the short link feature. On a short link feature, you can fix up a default message that the person can send you the moment he clicks on the advertisement. Now, this link that you see here, is the link that you basically integrate with all your digital advertisements. You can integrate this with your Google Ads, you can integrate this with your Facebook Ads, but in this case today, we are going to integrate this with Facebook advertisements. Now, this link is all set. So you take this link and you proceed further. Now, before you do something, you go back to your business settings section, you click on the greeting message and you set up a default welcome message that a person would get the moment he or she sends you the message that you have set in the link section. Now, what is this greeting message? Let's say I'm telling you, hey guys, what's up? How are we doing? Send me a WhatsApp message to stay connected. And the moment you click on that advertisement, you send me that message up there, which you see saying that, hi, Soro, how are we doing? The moment you send me that message, which is a default template message that you would send to me, I am more likely to respond to you when I'm available. But since I might not be available all the time, I can, set, I can set a default message up there which will come to you immediately the moment you send me a message. So once your link is ready and your greeting message is all set, you log on to your Facebook advertisements dashboard and uh, as you log on to the dashboard, you basically choose a traffic campaign. Now you click on create an ad. The generic process of running Facebook advertisements, I'm sure by now you would be aware of how do we do this. So you click on create an ad. If, you have, if you're if you not aware, do not worry, watch my video where I talk about how to run Facebook advertisements, where you learn about lead generation or you can subscribe to my Facebook advertising masterclass. The link is right there in the description. Okay, now let's understand about Facebook advertisements uh, from a traffic campaign perspective. So when you are running your Facebook ads, you choose your traffic campaign. As you click on traffic campaign, you give your campaign a name, whatever name that you would like to give. Click on set up an ad account. If you are here for the first time or you might be directly routed. So choose your time zone click on continue as you click on continue you have an option of where do you want to route the traffic to so you choose website that's one important thing that you do the second important thing that you basically do here is while you choose your placements you are clicking on edit placements and in this you particularly choose only mobile phone and not desktop so you disable desktop here so it's only mobile phone why because whatsapp is on mobile phone and only when people are looking at your advertisements on mobile phone they can click and directly send you a whatsapp so click on mobile phone so click on mobile as an option in edit placement as you proceed in your budget whatever budget you're trying to pick please feel free to do that in your advanced options you should basically see how you can optimize the campaign for link clicks 
so these are some of the important fixations that you need to do while you are devising your campaign so the next important thing is how do you design your facebook advertisements and how do you connect your advertisement to your whatsapp for business account so let's look at it right now. so while you create your new advertisement you need to be aware of the communication that you make so you have to select the link which directs people to the particular website and something that you have to understand is this is where you will place that url which you got while you were editing the link section in business settings of your whatsapp so you take that link and you place it right here and as you place the link right here remember your communication needs to have whatsapp us very strongly if you see it says we are where you interested in visiting whatsapp us for free pickup again this one says tamram home mela whatsapp for free pickup happening today so you are trying to create a differentiation because everybody is saying sign up book now you are the only guy up there who is right now creating the unique proposition by telling people to whatsapp you and as they whatsapp you they are rooted to your whatsapp for business account now you can see this is the advertisement they click on learn more the moment they click on learn more they see this message so this is the ad copy which goes on the feed of people as they click on this one they get to see this and as they get to see this the moment they send this message the message is i would like to visit the tamram home mela today can you share more info which is a default message which we have already set as in template and when they send this to us when they click on the send button here they are more likely to see this and they when click on when they click on the send button up there they are more likely to see a default reply from us which is already set up there as a greeting message up on whatsapp for business so with this i will end up my video and if you have any questions please feel free to ask me in the description of this video and do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel because i am going to share a lot of free insights on digital marketing only for you and not to forget i have a instagram channel so please do follow me on instagram my instagram channel is instagram.com/sorofjane see you guys right there dhanyawad